Hello good people of Indiegogo. First off, I am going to do something very unusual off the top by suggesting to people that if they have the time or the money um, to put something towards the disaster relief in Canada. As you may have heard on the news yesterday, there were two disasters in Canada. One in Quebec where there was a massive train dera derailment and explosion of oil, of crude oil. Um, people's lives were lost, and I'm sure homes and uh, livelihoods were lost as well because it took out a big chunk of, uh, of this town. And also to flood relief in Toronto because they had a torrential downpour yesterday to the point that one of the major studios, the one that shoots Saving Hope in fact, had to close down early. Now, if a major studio had to do this, you can imagine what it's done to the private homeowners in uh, in Toronto, and especially the lower income ones. So please be angels and get something to them. Speaking of angels, thank you so much to our angel contributor. Um, and when I say angel contributor, I mean someone who wants to remain anonymous, who put in $100 yesterday morning Thank you so much for that. You will be receiving your perk in the mail, which will be an autographed um, script along with an 8x10 photo of the cast in that particular episode. In terms of news at my end, I am uh, going to be looking at a secondhand sewing machine this evening. A relative of mine loaned me some money so I can pick it up if it works. Um, but yeah, I got that. Um, like I got that little loan, so I can pick that up. And also, I've been doing location scouting on the large property. I'm hoping to shoot about half of the web series on. Now, this is the property that I require the twenty-three hundred dollar uh, insurance policy for, um, and it is rather important that I get that. So I'm hoping I can make that amount on here. And just as a quick note to those of you who don't quite know how Indiegogo campaigns run, always, always, always a portion of whatever for I fundraise goes straight back into Indiegogo to maintain their website costs. If I make the 7500 Canadian, or if I make more than that, then it's a 4% cut that they take. However, if I do not make that amount, even if I make, you know, 7499 then they take off 9%. So keep that in mind when you see the total here and realize that, you know, until I get to that $7,500 mark, that there's 9% that's going to be coming off of there going back to Indiegogo. Um, but that being said, I have confidence that uh, we'll at least be able to make the amount for that insurance. I'm hoping we make more than that. Thank you so very much for your time. Oh yes, and if you want to share, scroll down to the bottom. There are some lovely uh, uh, different uh, share buttons there for Twitter and Facebook and other uh, social media platforms. Uh, so use those for sharing. Uh, thank you so much for your time. I look forward to hearing back from you, and I'll be talking to you in the future. See you later.